How's it going, you guys? I uh, was just looking through a one of my catalogs here, one of my large supplier catalogs, and came across this page, which is an NGK spark plug page uh, telling you about what the letters mean, what they mean, you know, as far as a particular part number of a NGK spark plug. And I just thought it was interesting. May may not do anything for anybody or help anybody, but I just thought it was interesting info. If you want to, uh, you know, just check out this page real quick. You know, it tells you the different cross cuts and gap styles of plugs, and then when you start looking at the part numbers themselves, what each, like if it's for the first one, if it has this particular letter. That means it's going to be this thread diameter. And then the uh, second letter will tell you the construction, what the uh, plug is made of. Pretty interesting. Same with the, if it's an R, you know, it's a resistor type. And then the number itself in the middle, kind of odd how the higher the number, the colder the temperature range is. You'd have thought they would have done that in reverse, but uh, but yeah, if you were wanting a hotter plug, so to speak, you need a lower number. And then the uh, suffix, you're talking the reach, what type of taper seat, and there's various dimensions that are involved, depending on if it's this letter in the part number, and then at the end, the firing end construction. V groove, booster gap, fine wire, standard center, half heat range, racing version, racing type, dual ground, single ground, special design, as well as the uh, the wide gap. If uh, yeah, I just thought it was interesting info. So you may want to pause this and have a look at it if it's something that could help you. Or just gives you some knowledge, basically, you know, of what the part numbers mean for NGK spark plugs. And then on the lower part of the page, the different resistor covers. Also, kind of neat info, depending on the part number. The external appearance, the adaptable plug size, the resistance in ohms. Uh, the adaptable plug terminal. Then the accessory. Is it a special waterproof cover or a rubber sheath? Just kind of neat. Neat stuff. Uh, check out our other videos. You know, we're always posting stuff on motorcycles and dirt bikes and Harley Davidsons, Yamahas, cars, lawnmowers. Just stuff. You know, we're always posting things that may help somebody out. So uh, like, subscribe, follow, blah, blah, blah. And um, I do not, I am. I mean, I do use NGK plugs in a lot of my motors. But, you know, I'm not sponsored by them or I don't really care. I just thought this was an interesting page of information in one of my supplier's catalogs. So do with it what you will. All right, y'all have a great day. We'll see y'all later.